New Orleans, and this is going to teach her otherwise. She's going to be booked and processed, both of them, down at Central Lockup, and they're going to have to uh, take care of this matter before leaving the city limits. Due to the graphic nature of this program, viewer discretion is advised. <laughs> edition of cops is filmed on location with the men and women of law enforcement all suspects are innocent until proven guilty in a court of law we're en route to an auto accident uh it's been called in as an accident but they said the parties now are possibly fighting and they have uh names of a couple of persons involved so they do know who the parties are involved but we're trying to figure out um exactly what's going on yeah they're up here Is the, your wife here? Yeah, that's the one that's doing all the mayhem. Right here. Okay. Yeah. What happened? Oh, no, she ain't right there. She's, she's in the car, make sure she ain't trying to start it. That's the okay. one. Okay. Because she's drunk. She's okay. gone. All right, hang on a second. Stay right there. She ain't trying. All right, hang on a second. She hit my car. Look. Okay. Look at that. His wife is in this car. She's sitting up here beating him like he's some daggone dog. They fighting or whatever. Ma'am. Ma'am, roll the window down. Ma'am. Do me a favor. Hello. Just stand over there. See that door's open. Ma'am, open the door for me. Ma'am. Open the door. Ma'am. You got a key? I'll go see if I have my key. Yeah, you if you could key? do that. I'm about to say, I ain't trying to. Hold on, let me make sure. If you can't do it, I'll just say, what's going on? What, who, is, who is she mad at? She mad at me. We, we supposed to be. Why was she not letting me in? Huh? Which key is it? I'm trying to see. It might not be on there. Hold on. Because it was in the door when I stopped her. That's when she bit me because I was trying to make sure she didn't drive. She bit you? She. All right. I'm saying the con. Ma'am, open the door, please. Yeah, he's in number four. He's she's just, yeah, she's going to have to go for DUE. Ma'am, open the door. Open the door. Open the door. You're going to get tased. Okay? Open the door. All I got to say is. Open the door. I'm not drunk. Open the door. Open that door right there. You're going to get tased. You hear me? That's fine. Then get out. Okay? Go ahead and get out that door. Thank you. No problem. Step out to that door. You don't have to touch me. Yes, I do. Step out of the car. No, you don't. I'm getting out of the car. Get out of the car. Step out now. Okay, so you can get off of me. Get out of the car. Step out. You can get off. Me. I'm, get getting out out out. I'm getting out voluntarily. I'm getting out voluntarily. You okay, can get, get off. Ma'am, so right now you're me. under arrest. So, okay, get off of me. You're under arrest. That's fine. Get off of me. I'm getting out voluntarily. Are you going to step out? I'm yeah. getting out. She's getting out. Put your hands behind, Put your, hands behind your back. Look, all I got to say Put your hands behind your back. I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> okay. Put your hands behind your back. Now. Put your hands behind your back. I can't believe y'all are doing this to me. Watch, I'm going to get you. Watch, I'm going to see y'all. Stay right there. Stay right there. 3425. Stay your supervisor. I can't smoke, bitch. What you think I'm going to do? Oh, my God. I ain't hurting y'all nothing but a bitch. You going to stand up for us? Are you going to stand up for us? I could if I would, but I can't. Well, help you. Oh, my God. She's got the barbs in her. Just let her lay there. <laughs> Ma'am, you need to relax, okay? Those barbs are still in you, and if you don't relax, you're going to get it again, all right? Just relax yourself, all right? And we'll take those out in a minute. So bad. I know. I, I... <laughs> that is your wife? Oh, yes, sir. Okay. You want to tell me from the beginning what happened? She came out here drunk, passed out right there, threw up. Okay. Then she made it to there, passed out, threw up. I had her keys. I put them in her purse, threw the purse on the other side. Then I knew my cat was coming, said about 15 minutes. So I kept on trying to wake her, like, come on, it's time to go. Go upstairs. And you know, and getting, you know when someone's drunk and sensitive. Then after a while, she started getting to thing, like, fake teary eyed. Then she's like, 
uh, I'm going to get my son. Started the car. Okay. I'm like, stop, stop. And then that's when the gentleman up there, hopefully he should be coming, pulled into like right here. She hit it hard, bam, almost, I don't know how far it knocked him over there. But then she's like, oh, I'm sorry. The guy jumped out, like, who had my car out? Pointed to her. She started going that way, trying to, I guess, swoop out real quick. Okay. Hit that like three times. I kept on telling you, you're hitting the car, you're hitting the car. And then finally. What car was she hitting originally? She hit that car first and kept on backing into that one. Because the way she had it, the car was like this, right? Part like that. She kept on back, not paying attention. That's when I grabbed the keys and turned the car off. That's when she okay. bit me right here. I then when she that. got outside, she started throwing hellmakers. That's when she caught me in my nose and got me in my lip. Okay. And then she got back in the car? She eventually got back in the car, but she already had her keys, and I threw them somewhere over there. You might end up finding them. Okay. So the other keys, she has her own set. Yeah, she has her own you set. You have a different set. I have a, yeah. Okay. Amanda, what happened between you and Brandon tonight? Well, um, after I left him at the precinct, at precinct after he had broke my windshield, um, I came here. Then all of a sudden he came to my door, he started knocking on my door, I said, look, Brennan, I'm busy, I don't want to talk to you. And he's like, oh, well, no, 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 I, I mean, I'm not going to do none of that, I just want you to give me a pop, I just want you to treat me with respect. How did he get the bite mark on his chest? Because I bit him, because he wouldn't leave me alone. Okay. So I bit him, because he kept strong-arming me. Okay, did you punch him in the face also? No, I don't, I don't remember that. Earlier we were fighting, yes. Because he wouldn't, he wouldn't even let me go anywhere. He doesn't let me have friends. He doesn't let me do anything. Okay. Do me a favor. Go ahead and put your feet in the car. And I'm going to explain some other things to you here in just a second. That's all right? Fine. Did yes. you see them fighting? <laughs> yes. Okay. When I pulled up the first time, okay. she was out here punching him in the face. Punching him? Yes. Okay. Punching him, striking him in his chest. I mean, okay. his his nose was like bleeding real, he's, real bad. He's got a big bite mark. Did you see her bite him? No, or? I didn't see her okay. bite him. I just seen her punching him, hitting him in the face. He didn't hit her. He didn't touch her not one okay. time. Okay. I even screamed out like, "Don't hit her!" He was like, "I'm not going to hit her." Okay. And um, she. Does that all happen right out here in the driveway? Yes, okay. right here. Okay. And that was all before we got here, obviously? Yeah, that was before. Okay. okay. Amanda. Yes, sir. We're clear on why you're going to the Justice Center, right? I told you you were under arrest for domestic violence. I guess so. And uh, I've been trying to put them under arrest for the same thing. Um, so right now you're under arrest for domestic violence. That's what you're going to the Justice Center for. That's fine. And there'll, there'll be an issue with uh, the car and the auto accident up here. I don't even know of an auto 